what's up guys and welcome back to another video i'm gonna be showing you a quick tutorial on rust again i'm bringing back a rust a few rust videos maybe and i'm gonna show you a good performance settings for your your rust so you get maximum fps out of your computer and stuff like that so first of all go to options obviously and then go to i mean field of view doesn't really matter I have mine at 90. I'm basically telling you what my settings are, which I've learned from other people. Um, streamer mode, all these are personal preference. Underwear, um, I have underwear on because it technically can boost your FPS. I mean, I don't know. Like, it's kind of common sense, but. And then max gibbs, you want this at zero because when something breaks, when an object breaks or something, then all the pieces that like break down from that, like a wall, uh, for example, uh, when it breaks, you know, a stone wall, there's like a bunch of stones that come off of it. This will lessen that down if you turn it all the way down. So you'll be able to see um, in a shorter time. User interface, I have mine at one. Uh, all these don't really matter. It's whatever you want. Audio. Um, master volume, I have it at 8, and then, uh, I don't use any of this music stuff, but, uh, my voices, they recently changed this so you can turn it up really high for some reason, but I have mine at, like, 0.7, I don't really have very good audio settings, but, um, game sounds, I have that almost all the way up, and then instruments, I have it so I can barely hear it, speaker mode, you want that stereo, Controls, um, all these controls are actually pretty good that they have, but you can customize those. And then, uh, I play on point three two. See right here, point three two. Sensitivity, um, it's just, uh, so you can aim better and stuff like that. I play on stretched right here, um, borderless, so I can switch tabs because I have two monitors. And... This is what you guys want to do. Turn VSync off, by the way. That, that'll that mess up your input delay a lot. Um, what you guys want to do is do FPS dot... Oh, my God. And then put zero right here. And that'll uncap your FPS so you get the most FPS possible. Um, it won't, like, limit to zero because... <laughs> I mean, zero is, like, no FPS, but... It'll just uncap it. So, I mean, you can turn it all the way up to 240, but I just do that. So it uncaps it. All right, graphic settings. These are, these are important for your performance. So I have mine at all the way up on the graphics quality. And then shadow quality, zero. No cascades. These are PvP settings, kind of. So it's not going to look the best. Um, all these down. And then shader level is about 200. This should be 12, 1250 actually. I don't know why it changed. But around 1250, try to get it 1250. Just around 1250 because that's like the max you can see basically. Um, and then all this down. And then grass displacement is on because it displaces the grass when you walk over it. And then all these try to keep it around half, like 50, like half right here because um, it'll just give you a little bit of FPS boost because you don't want these all the way up and then all this stuff is gonna be off because um, these are just like eye candy stuff which doesn't really matter and then experimental all these off and then another thing not not for your FPS but just for your regular game um, you can choose to do this if you want to or not. What I was going to say is you want to do bind and then space forward uh, colon or semicolon sprint and then whatever space, whatever key you want. Uh, your It's basically like auto run. So whenever you press this key that you sign it to, it'll sprint until you um, move some other way. So, which is really helpful when you're running like long distances or whenever you just like want to get a drink or something or just do whatever you you, you want to do. 
other than play the game while you're doing other stuff. But I have mine at Z. And if you do that, it'll um, set that as a bind. Set it to whatever key you put there. And then every time you press Z, for example, it, when you're in the game, it'll start running forward. So that is my settings, guys. And if you don't know how to do stretch resolution, stretch resolution is optional. But I like I I, I personally like it. But um, play on exclusive full like that's like super or all the way full screen if you really want to because um, that will probably make your game a little bit smoother but I have two monitors so I, I just like alt tabbing a lot and going to discord and stuff so that's why I have it on full borderless but that's that's all for the video guys thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed my settings and tell me in the comments what other videos I should do like rust or fortnite whatever or another game even so thank you guys so much for watching leave a like if you enjoyed and peace out